What's up YouTube, welcome back to my channel. In today's video we're gonna be looking at Crackshot. He is a legendary outfit. He is part of the Nutcracker set. He does come with a backing in Birdshot. And for this video I'm actually gonna be reviewing the newest Crackshot edit stuff, which is called the Skull Shot. So without further ado guys, let's get this review started. So, Crackshot. With this Crackshot edit style. Now this edit style is actually very cool. I do like it that they are using copper with black and white because the combinations of colors just fit very well. The back end itself also got a selectable style to actually match this selectable style, which is pretty cool. The first shot itself is actually made like a skull and he does have those copper wings and feet. But is he better than the original? I don't think any of the styles is better than the original because the original is very iconic. It does have the whole Christmas theme, but then this new style, the skull shot actually does resemble a lot Halloween. I'm actually baffled why they actually selected to have a new edit style on him on Christmas, which this should have been a selectable style back during Halloween. Don't get me wrong, it is a free selectable style if you did have the skin already, so I really can't complain. So what's my final rating for Crackshot with the skull shot edit style? I'm gonna have to give Crackshot with the skull shot edit style an 8 out of 10. What I really like about this edit style is the painting he does have on his head. It's actually very creepy, but it fits him very well. Another thing that I actually did like about this selectable style is that the backlink itself, the first shot, actually got out the similar selectable style, which he didn't get one for last year when we did get the pink and the blue one. Overall, I do think the selectable style fits him very good, and hopefully they do this for Crackabella, which honestly, I don't think they are. So without further ado guys, let's get this combo started. Now, for our first combination with Crackshot with the Skullshot edit style, I am pairing it up with Tana. Now, the Tana backlink, in my opinion, is the best backlink you could utilize with this outfit. Now, the backlink itself does have copper similar to the outfit itself, and it also has the blade holder that is all black. Then, for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Weather Gold. Now, the Weather Gold itself does have that like faded gold color scheme that kind of looks like copper, and it just fits this combination really well. And for the glider, we're going to be going with the Bounty Brilla. The Bounty Brilla itself does primarily have all gold, but it still looks very nice. The gold itself is a little bit of like pale, so it matches really good with the harvesting tool. Then the, the Medusa head does have that copper color scheme that looks very clean. Then for the control, we're gonna be going with the Spectral Essence. The Spectral Essence itself does have that wind control that is white that is similar to that of the white of the outfit. And now wrapping this whole combination together, we're gonna be going with Midas Memory. I know the Midas Memory does have that gold color scheme, but it also has brown. The brown actually complements really good with the copper and it fits very nice together. So let's check out this combo. For the next combination with Crackshot with the Crack Skull edit style, I am pairing it up with the Ice Mantle with the Silver edit style. Now the Ice Mantle itself actually complements the white that the outfit does have. It actually looks very clean because it does look like a keep itself and it looks amazing. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Kraken Axe. The Kraken Axe itself does have that same carbon steel that the skin does have. It looks really good, it matches really good with the carbon the skin does have. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the Scully Sailor. The Scully Sailor itself does have that whole skull feeling to it that just complements the outfit itself. Then for the control, we're going to be going with the Storm Strike. The Storm Strike itself does have Storm hitting the hands themselves and it looks really cool. And for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Boogeyman. The Boogeyman wrap does have an all matte black finish that just looks very good with any black outfit. So let's check out this combo. For the next combination with Crackshot with the Crack Skull edit style, I am pairing it up with the Bone Wings. You have to admit, the Bone Wings themselves actually fit perfectly. The Wings themselves are completely all black, it does have the skeleton painting on them that just complement the outfit very well. Then for the Harvesting Tool, we're going to be going with the Shadow Caliber. The Shadow Caliber Harvesting Tool does have that black with white color scheme that just looks amazing. 
Then for the glider, we're gonna be going with the web umbrella. The web umbrella itself does have that matte black finish with the Spider-Man imprint on it that just looks very good and complements the outfit very well. And for the glider, we're gonna be going with the web umbrella. The web umbrella does have that matte black finish with the spider web imprint on it that just complements the outfit very well. Then for the contra, we're gonna be going with the silver ribbons. The silver ribbon does have that black and white color scheme that's, in, that's leaving the body that matches really good with the color paint. And for the wrap, we're gonna be going with the weather black. The weather black itself does have that faded black color scheme that is identical to that of the outfit. So let's check out this combo. Now, for the honorable mentions with Crack Shot with the Crack Skull Edit Style, you could pair it up with anything that does have brown, black, and even copper. It's gonna look really good with this outfit. For the next combination, we are going to be using Birdshot with the Bird Skull Edit Style and we're going to be pairing it up with the Mandalorian with the default Edit Style. Now the reason why I'm using the Mandalorian for this combination is because everybody should actually have him if you're actually playing this season. Now the Mandalorian with the Birdshot just looks really good. His wings are made of copper color scheme so it matches really good with the brown color scheme that the Mandalorian does have. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Tree Splitter. The reason why I'm using the Tree Splitter is because it's a very simplistic harvesting tool but it matches really good with the Mandalorian. Then for the glide, we're going to be going with the Custom Flyer with the default that is done. Now the Custom Flyer itself, the wings are particularly are brown so it matches really well with this combination. And for the Contra, we're going to be going with the Ballistics. I know he does use a laser gun but the ballistic just fits really well because he's always using ammo. And for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Call Sign Falcon. The Call Sign Falcon itself does have a similar brown color scheme than that of the outfit and that's why it matches perfectly. So let's check out this combo. For the last combination with Burst Shot with the Skull Shot Edit Style, we are pairing it up with a Bigfoot. Now Bigfoot with the Burst Shot itself actually just looks very dorky. The wings themselves and even the little feet that are made of copper actually complement his fur very well. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Stompy. The Stompy harvesting tool is basically just a tree branch with a stump on it which actually complements the whole Bigfoot theme very well. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the palm leaves. Bigfoot is known for living in the forest, so the palm leaves is the closest thing we do have for a glider. Then for the contra, we're going to be going with the satellite. The satellite itself is basically just fireflies leaving the body, and the fireflies are normally in the forest, so it matches really good with the whole theme as well. And for the wrap, we're going to be going with the sap. The sap just complements both the glider and the harvesting tool. As you can tell, it is basically just a tree branch. It does have that green color scheme that complements the glider itself, and then for the brown, it just complements everything else. So let's check out this combo.
for the honorable mention with a bird shot with the skull shot at a stealth, you could pair him up with anything that does have black, white, and even brown or copper is actually gonna match really good with this outfit. Those are the three combinations I did find for Crack Shot with the Crack Skull Edistout, and those are the two combinations I did find for the Bird Shot with the Bird Shot Edistout. Let me know in the comments below which one's your favorite. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe. I post videos for fake cosmetic skins every single day. And if you want to support the channel, my code is Enigma Kid, all caps, two Ds, all together. Each time you guys use my code in the item shop or the Epic Game Store, I do get a small percentage of it and really help this channel grow. And if you guys have any comments, suggestions, leave them in the comments below. And for all my social media and Discord, they'll be in the description. And with that being said, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.